Alright guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. Today we're playing a Master Yi top lane versus a Yorick top. And for the runes, we have Lethal Tempo, Triumph, Alacrity, Elastant, Bone Plating specifically. And then also Overgrowth for the Scaling. Now this game we're going to have a really fun time playing Master Yi top lane. As you guys know, it's like one of the best hyperscaling champions in the entire game. And of course, if you play Mastery Top Lane, you have all of the XP all for yourself to scale. So if you're playing Mastery Jungle, you need a lot of time to scale in the game because you're actually going to be behind in levels. But if you're playing Top Lane, you don't. You don't fall behind. That's the difference. So yeah, be aware about that. You're going to have a good time if you're playing Top Lane. Nice start for Yorick, actually. Maybe I can get level 2 first. Maybe. Ah, he still got it first. Feels bad, man. Maybe it's okay. Maybe it's okay. Oh. Oh. I don't have my W. I'm, I'm already dead. Shaco level 2. Okay. We're gonna have a rough start. Yep, that's always the danger of Shaco. It is what it is. I actually wanted to cheese him level 2, but thinking about it now, it's, it would never work. Because if there's a Shaco nearby... If I had the wave flag pushing into York right now, it would be a lot worse. But at least right now, like we're still getting back to the lane before it hits the tower. So we're not losing ex as much XP. It's actually kind of fine. It's okay. At the same time, we got my teammates losing at the moment, so rough start it is. The most annoying thing about Yorick is that he's going to be getting us stuck in the lane. Alright, we'll back off now. Okay. So, the real fun is when we specifically level, level 6 and also get the Berserker's Greaves. Until then, we're kind of like farming in the game. We'll be taking it very slow. We also have Ghost, he's running TB Flash. If I have Ignite Ghost and I have my Berserker's Greaves, maybe with like one kill more, uh, we can just run, run him over at level six. My ultimate should be better than his. That's like the point where we start out scaling, but it also heavily depends on the lead. Since I was top lane, so maybe we can make like a fancy little play. Yep, since I was actually moving top. I don't think I can get the cannon. Oh, made it out. Let's go. Exactly what I needed. I kind of wish I had the kill for myself, because it would actually change my entire laning. But whatever, I guess. I would have been able to buy the Berserker's Greaves if uh, if I maybe had it. Like, I'd be very close to my Berserker's Greaves then. Now I still have to try and get it. Nice. Okay, we've got we've got a pretty good start. So we previously died before. It's actually gonna be a full out of the Yorick. Very well done. The wave is pushing towards me. I, I hope that my jungler is gonna go top again to try and gank Yorick because the as you can see the wave is uh going straight into me. He doesn't have any vision at the moment. We have Xin Zhao moving forward, so who knows? We may be able to make this work. He's gonna go for the cannon. Oh, here we go. Oh, he's keeping his boat stuck here. Okay. Why is he walking into that direction, though? Oh, he's definitely dead. Ah, uh, again. Uh, the Xin Zhao gets the kill. Whatever, I guess. It's 
walk back here. I don't want to get caught by a Shaco combo. Honestly, like if you if you were to ask me, like you can, it's always best to give the kills up to the to the laner because you, you, the laner is going to benefit from it so much. If the jungler gets the kill each time, you're not really helping. You're helping the laner, but like it's not as good as it could have been. But yeah, we have the wave pushing it to me, so he's going to lose even more X speed right here. There could be a Shaco top, of course. Nice. Let's see if we can push a little bit forward. Oh, he actually cast an ultimate. <laughs> the instant Yorick ultimate cast. I was actually kind of scared that was going to happen. I actually was. It's a scary thought uh, to have a Yorick ultimate constantly activated. Of course. So that's the game we're playing now, huh? Let's play one versus two. Okay. Sounds exciting. Sounds exciting. So. How long is Shaco going to be here? Let's find out. At least I like their intentions. Uh, Mocha? I don't know, man. That's... Weird, I guess. Let's push this out the entire way, then we head back. We don't have the mana. Oh, it seems like Talon is going to be roaming top now. Or not, he doesn't roam top lane, actually. I'll push in. Great. So, time to back off. We got 1.8. We're going to go into Berserker's Greaves. And uh, next item is going to be this one, this one. And I think I might just go for a little bit more attack speed so I can have more damage. Let's get back here. We actually we actually have a solid lead into Yorick right now because he's been sharing XP with Shaco the entire time. So, we're level 8 right now. Yorick is actually level 7. And we also have like a slight item advantage. It's not that big, but it will certainly make a big difference. Nice. Shaco is in mid lane. That's good to know. Again, there's not much we can do right here. It's better to just let the wave push into me and then just wait. Shaco seems to be going top lane again for the third time. I saw him running from mid lane to top lane, so I think he's here now. I guess. Let's see if I can thin this out. So Yorick is actually farming this camp right here. He's actually taking it with the enemy jungler together. There's a Shaco up here. So I'm just going to let the wave continue to push into me so I can make like a slight XP advantage. Tank this as well. I think I can zone him out some XP here because he's probably scared of me at the moment. And we got all four of these. Hmm. I guess I'm about to get wrecked by a Shaco, so I'm going to walk away. Yo, are these guys duo cure or something? I don't know. These guys must be duo cure or something. I'll hold it. Nice. Yeah, I'm definitely holding this. I need to see if York will come back here. I got, I got my Ignite ready, so if he does come back, I can beat him. Well, kind of, I guess. I don't know if Shaco is still up here. Hmm. <laughs> he probably figured out that there's a vision over there. 
Oh, he's ghosting immediately? Oh, there's a Shaco here again? Shaco is still top lane? After all this time? And there's a Talon up here. <laughs> How many ganks do you need, bro? Ah, it still hits me at the end of the day. These guys are dedicated. Okay, I'm gonna be backing off. I am not... I don't want to fight them anymore. Well, maybe I can. Hold on. I can't use more of my W. If I use more, then uh, I can't use my Q uh, QR combo anymore. That York ultimate is kind of... I still top lane? After all this time? We're, he's like top lane for five minutes. He's never left. No way. I refuse to believe. These guys are a joke? These guys are a joke? They're top lane the entire game. The Shaco just doesn't go farm jungle camps anymore. He's just actually focusing me only. Okay. I somehow think that Talon is top lane. Let's go. I'm, I'm getting out. He teleported straight up. Let's get my uh, let's get my blade. Nice. Gives motivation without purpose. I bet you 90 no 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 not just 99%. 200 200 percent chance that Shaco is actually running top lane again and just waiting for me to show. Do we have a concha wood in the tri bush? Tower is actually gone. We lost the entire tower like this. No way, man. Okay. At least we're, we we got the kills and everything. We got obliterated by Shaka. Okay, Shaka isn't here. That's some good news. And, uh... The plates are gone. That's a two level difference between me and this Yorick. I don't know if he saw me, but... I also think that the... Okay, Talon's not actually here, so... I mean, we're playing the scaling game. It's gonna be an easy win if Kale also starts scaling. This is not good for Yorick. Like, he doesn't get to play the game anymore. Uh, Yorick is supposed to win against me, not lose against me. If he actually starts losing it to me, um, I can scale the game for free and I'll eventually just beat the game. Even now, I can farm jungle camps. Yorick will push. So, it's just efficiency for me. Let's go back top lane. Found this out. Nice. Shaco's still missing. Oh. Okay. Seems like Talon is moving top lane, so I'm gonna have to run out. I'm actually pretty excited for the moment where I can just press my W and just heal back everything. Having like five points in it. I think that Talon is still top lane, by the way. I don't think it has really changed. Yeah, uh, Talon is still going top lane over and over. Uh, 
This is very bad. Three people top lane. Um, uh, four people. Yeah, he, he probably knows that I'm like right around the corner. So he wouldn't fall for it. Oh, let's go back top lane. I'm honestly very excited for the moment where I have my second item because things will dramatically change once I get to buy my second item. I'm thinking about going for... Wait, what? I'm thinking about going for specifically this item, but I'm also thinking about going Kraken Slayer. I really like Kraken Slayer, actually. But I think it's uh, probably going to end up going for the, this item. It's the best item you can you can buy at the moment. I feel like York is backing. I don't think he's going to stay around. Yeah, it does not show. It's like I suspect. Let's get the next item real quick, which will, uh, by the way, it will help me a ton like farming jungle camps too. And more attack speed, always appreciated. We're going to try and build at the same time into Kraken Slayer so we can be efficient with the uh, with the gold. I think that Yorick is going to be farming this jungle camp right here, so... And Shaco is top lane as usual. And he's... I bet you he's still in the jungle camp. Yeah. He probably... Still skew. Yeah, he, he has skew. See if I can push the upcoming wave. There's actually multiple people running top lane. Oh, uh, okay. Nice. Good one. I tried to get the... I should have casted my E sooner. It's whatever, I guess. It's okay. I could have killed him. Well... Look how close I am to this item. I just need to get 600 more. This item will change the entire game if I can get it. Moldra's dead. Yeah. Shot down. Nice. Let's go. I should have my item in the next uh, next two minutes. I should have it. Pretty sure that Zin Zin Zao would have maybe won that stuff. Despite the two level difference. It's running back top lane, so maybe... I can catch him on his way to top. Or we don't. Maybe he knows that I'm just waiting for him because there's probably wards. Again, nice push. We can get tower. If Yorick is going to help a dragon, then we will get tower for free, which will give us the item that we need. Oh, he's actually up here. I think that maybe Yorick is going to place a war down in this brush right here. And then maybe he will actually walk into the wave. Maybe I'm wrong, but let's wait like a tiny second. Nah, never mind. Still seems to be here. 
Let's go back. He's playing it safe. Uh, that's certainly going to make a big difference. We have the core build right now. We got Blade and we also have this item. And the next item is probably going to be a Kraken Slayer, I think. And maybe some AoE damage would be certainly be very nice. We'll take next wave, then we go back top lane. Talon is still dead. Alright, let's go back. More attack speed. Let's go. I'm gonna get that recurve bow. Then we go back top lane. Top lane is pushing into me, so they're uh, pretty much losing all of the farm. Don't think we're going to see Yorick because I suspect that Yorick is going to be facing off Kale in bot lane. Or Talon, actually. Lulu's on Dragon. Shaco is the only guy still missing. I have no idea where Shaco is. I think I'm not even going to bother trying to 1v1 a Yorick because I think he will never walk out of this part right here. He will just keep on playing it safely. Poor jungle camps. Well, let's see what we can do. Yeah, Yorick still doesn't show. Kind of tough to beat Smolder and Lulu at the same time. Because I think if I jump on Smolder, then Lulu will hit the knockup. Oh, there also seems to be a Shaco. Tough choice to make, but I'm going for it because top lane is getting wrecked soon. Nice. Yorick is still pushing top. I'm going to ask my teammates if they can go top lane for me. More efficient. No jungle camps, but there is a tower that we can get. Maybe we can even go for a second tower because uh, it's only Shaco. Oh. He's teleporting for this stuff? All right, sure. He just have teleport next time, so it's not worth it for him. Ah, Shaco is trying to gank me from the back here. We have 1.3k. We need to have like a thousand more. Let's give that to my jungler. There will be a team fight now, and it's gonna be the full team against the other. Okay, Shaco's trying to chase me down. Oh, I actually chose the wrong. No, you kidding? Oh, no, that's so bad, man. That's gonna be Baron. If I didn't choose the wrong one, I would have beaten him so easily. I was about to hit my Q. I didn't even use my W. I was actually thinking very easy of Shaco. Yeah. Yeah, Varus can't face check. This is impossible. They, they're all doing Baron at the moment. It's not worth it. You know, normally in normally in a game like this, like uh, beating up a Yorick is so easy to do with Master Yi because you just all in whenever he, wherever you can find him. But Yorick is one in five, and honestly, he doesn't have to do much this game because his teammates are actually winning the game by themselves. There's nothing that Yorick has to do. He can just like back off and just watch the game as he actually gets a win. 
So this is not really a game where we get to snowball as hard, but when it, when there's a team fight, we should be able to win it. It shouldn't be that hard to be honest. Again, dragon is gone. I need like 300. Okay, I've got my item. Let's go. Let's see if we can split push. Let's see if we can beat this Yorick now. My ultimate is only 85. So if I see Yorick, I will immediately press my R. I will not hesitate because I can kill him easily. There's actually two people pathing top lane, so we don't get to do very much. Yeah, he's running into my direction. Nice fight. Wait, let me heal up. Nice. Honestly, like a like a bunch of assists for me. We can probably get even more. Let me see if that's actually jungle camps. No. Nothing to be found. We can get all the way up to the inhib, which will make a great difference in this game. Just forcing this one too. That's all we need. We don't need more. My teammates can just back off. It's okay. A bit of an overextend. The only thing we needed was the inhib. Got the jungle cam. Pretty good. Let's walk away from this. Because I think that Shaco will chase me down at this point. And I think they will still chase me down. More jungle camps. Nice. Okay. We can go for experimental hexblade next, but what we can also do is go into TMN. Uh tough choice to make right here. I think I'm gonna go into this item so I can have the AOE clear speed. And uh Titanic Hydra will also make me more tanky. Yeah, we're gonna be running off to. Uh, we're gonna be running off bot lane. I'll see if I can uh, split push. Uh, I hope I'll find either Talon or Yorick. Either one of them. Look at my damage. They'll have a very hard time against me right now. If they try and fight me, it is not going to be easy. I'll be one v twoing if I need to. So just wait patiently. Yorick is showing a top lane. Nobody seems to be showing up here. Smolder's top lane. Let's go. Just waiting for the right opportunity. I need to see where Shaco is still. I don't know where Shaco is. Still have to find him. Okay, he's also top lane. 1,000 damage. Let's go. That's without my E, by the way. Maybe there's a blue buff. Nope. There's no blue buff to be found anywhere. This jungle camp has also been taken. We uh, actually need Kale to show up. Oh, it got canceled. Not what I planned. Okay, I need my team to go dragon. Let's go, we have four items, Titanic Hydra. The last item that I need right now, okay? It's definitely a Guardian's Angel because 
they have a full AD team comp. They're all all lethality. They have three profane hydras in one team, meaning they can they have the burst. They they can they can delete me if they want to. So it's a scary one. Another dragon. No collection. And also Baron buff is showing at the moment. And we're almost level 18. We just need to have like one more. Shaco is showing in bot lane. Well, specifically bottom jungle. So we can just do this thing. We can we can do it super fast. Welcome to Master Yi Live, bro. This is the Master Yi. This is why, man. You should be playing Master Yi. You you can delete dragons, barons, you know, the whole the whole team fight in seconds if you like. Let's see if we can split push this the entire way out. Okay. Let's get some uh let's get some of the armor. Actually, I need to go into this item. So I'll just take the uh little bit of armor. It will definitely make like a slight difference. Let's go. Okay, I need a Kale ultimate. If I get a Kale ultimate, I'll be obliterating everybody. I don't want to be the guy to all in myself. I actually want my teammates to go in. Let's go. Thank you. GG, man. <laughs> Imagine if I could delete the entire thing. Game over. Hey, this is Master Yi Top Lane. Thanks so much for watching today's video. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.